Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. So in today's video, I'm going to be discussing mod support for chat room. So in the last update, I actually added in mod support, and I haven't actually discussed this because I want to discuss it in a separate video, which is this video. So mod authors can now add their items to chat room. Now this doesn't require any patches or uploading of new mods or anything. All mod authors have to do is go into their mod, add a script, if chat room is installed, it will add their items into chat room. If chat room isn't installed and their mod supports chat room, um, it just won't run the script that implements their items and their mod will still work fine. So yeah, normally you have to make patches and if you don't have certain things installed, it will crash your game and it just won't work. That doesn't happen here. Um, so it works really great. I've tested it with Moonpath to Elsewhere and Felscar and it's worked perfectly fine. And also every single creation club content. So, um, if you're a mod author and you want to do this, add your items to this container here, because that's what this new container is, um, you have permission to do that. Basically, in order to do that, go into the description of chat room, the Xbox One version on Bethesda.net. You'll see a line of code that says form list. Um, it's just a form list. Um, it just gets a form list from chat room. And you just want to add to that form list. And that will allow your items to show up in this container, basically. So, if there's mod authors out there that aren't too confident with scripting in the creation engine or the creation kit, and they don't understand how to use that line of code, I can possibly make a tutorial to show you how to implement your items from your mod into cheat room using that method. So, um, nonetheless, let me show you. So, at the moment, by default, every single Creation Club content mod is supported. So, when you press this button, you can see nothing's in here. Um, you can see nothing's in here, but when you press this button, slowly but surely, after it's done figuring out what it needs to figure out, it will slowly populate this container. And you can see it's just filling up with everything. Now, Felscar, as well as Moonpath to Elsewhere, items are in here so some items in here you won't actually see that's just because i was testing stuff out to see if this was fully working and did work did it you know just worked really so um you know you can see there's a lot of creation club stuff in here so like the lightning arrows and of course you can grab the stuff and it just replaces it instantly so you can grab as much as much of the stuff as you want now, you know, you could, you know, I'm just showing you really that it is actually working. So, um, if you are wanting a mod to be supported and its items to show up here, do not complain to me. Ask the mod author. This is not to do with me. This doesn't require my input or anything. It's up to the mod authors if they want to add support to cheat room. Um, they, all they have to do is implement a script, and it'll, it's fine. So, um, just to iterate again, because, uh, you know, people may don't listen. Um, this doesn't require patches. It doesn't require dependencies. It's a script. So... If cheat room is installed, and your mod supports cheat room, it will put its items in cheat room. If your mod supports cheat room, and cheat room is not installed, it just won't run the script, and your mod will still work fine. It won't crash the game. So, I just want to point that out. Because I don't want people to get confused and not understand if it will break the game. So, um, yeah, there you go. So, also in the latest update, I think I'll mention, um, the add all perks button no longer sets your rating, your armor rating to zero, because that was a bug, it's now been fixed. And this container's been added near the, uh, blacksmith forge, and it just gives you all the common crafting materials, so you can grab all this, and then craft stuff straight away. And it refills instantly, like all the other containers, and you can just go to your heart's content, because I've seen a couple video. Uh, a couple of video. What am I saying? I've seen a couple of people go to the containers over there, which only have one item, and come to here and duplicate everything until there are heaps of everything. So that just speeds up the process. 
and some people also requested that. So, that's what I wanted to talk about in this video. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the video. And yeah, let me know your thoughts about this new feature and whatnot in the comments. And yeah, uh, have a good one.